What's going on YouTube? Come back at you with another video. So Taxstone had put out a message about Takashi 69. This was shortly after Takashi had went live and explained exactly why he did what he did. I'm gonna read you what Taxstone said. He said it's a sad day in the world where people find sympathy, empathy, and reason in weak people's decisions. It shows the weakness in most of you. The point that was missed was that a man who committed crimes is now trying to justify why he cooperated. Why didn't he call the cops when he first got kidnapped? Why didn't he tell the feds that someone was embezzling his money that was working for him? Why? He cooperated because he did not want to receive the penalties for the risk that he took in the streets. No one put a gun to his head when he said put a hit on Chief Keefe. He chose to do that, but because he didn't want to go to prison, he decided to offer information on people. No one told him to fake gangbang. That was his decision. Just say you didn't want to go to jail, so you told. What did I Am Cardi B do for you to mention her? What did Casanova do to you? The two of you were just taking pictures together. So... Is this about the people who stole from you, fucked your girl, and tried to kidnap you? Or is this just about you not wanting to go to jail for the crimes that you committed? It should be illegal for people who commit crimes to get leniency for making things up about other people. Where they do that at, hashtag be safe though, only in America. I mean, Taxstone said it perfectly. I couldn't have said it any better. I, let's just look at the situation. Clearly, 6ix9ine told because he didn't want to go to prison. Um, why? Like he's saying, why wasn't he saying these things before the feds came and built a case on him and had him involved in this whole RICO? Why wasn't he um, saying anything about Cardi B? Like, what did, what did, like, what is he saying? Like, what did Cardi B do to 6ix9ine? What did Casanova do to 6ix9ine? What did Kuda B? Let's, let's specifically look at the Kuda B situation. 6 9 told Kuda B that he would pay him if he were to go shoot at Chief Keefe or shoot Chief Keefe, whatever the case may be. Kuda B did it, allegedly, and 6 9 turned around and told on him that he was supposed to be his friend. He actually had such a good relationship with Kuda B that there's a song out there about him or named Kuda. I mean, the shit is pretty clear. 6 9 is a bitch. 6 9 is a snitch. He gets no leniency. He gets no love. He gets no pass. The shit that he did was completely unacceptable. Whether you are in the streets or not, that's just what it is. End of story. Let me know what you guys think in the comments, though. Hit the like, subscribe, share. Leave some feedback. Make sure you ring the notification bell, too, if you're subscribed. I definitely appreciate you watching. Peace.